Because there are buildings like this that were valued yeah. at 25 million bucks at 2019. You fast forward five years, the term's up. They got to go back. The 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 Brookfield, the Pemco, and many others go, nope, we're not gonna, we're not putting in more equity. We're done. Here you yeah. go, Mr. Bank, Mrs. Bank. I mean, they they got that on the books at I don't know, let's say the debt's at 18 million. There was seven in equity, now it's 18. They're gonna sell that thing for four million bucks, three and a half. Yeah. I mean, yeah. They're going to take a huge haircut. I mean, the thing is like, you know, you got to be concerned about whether there's going to need to be some bank bailouts too. I mean, if, because some of these banks That's are going a good to be, question. We got to figure out which banks are concentrated in New York and San Francisco. Because I think this is very regional. Yeah. I mean, it hurt, it'll hurt everyone, but I think there are some concentrations. Like, um, yeah, I wonder if there's any New York banks that are very New York heavy. I don't know. Well, I mean, look, you've got, you know, Chase, Citibank, which are headquartered here. I'm sure. Yeah, they have no, a lot I'm, of, I'm thinking more like you know, the next tier, like New York Bank Mellon. Some of the smaller banks. Yeah. Right? So, yeah. I mean, they, they may be, you know, some of those banks may be exposed to these buildings, which, you know, look, three years ago, these were blue chip. Oh, they were great. You were bragging to your buddies. You were on the yeah. golf course going, hey, we just put a loan on this, uh, you know, New York skyscraper. Now you're like shit. We got eighteen million dollars in debt. We the, the assets worth four. That's an eighty percent write off. How's that going to feel? Yeah, yeah. It's it's going to be ugly, ugly. Yeah. For a lot of a lot of banks. 